Bethling finally uh, produced her numbers for her year ends for 2020, and the assistance goes as 18 to 68 48, uh, which created an increase per household by $200, but the total assistance went down to 25 from 38. But that made a total per household of $750.33. And if it's the water utility, made a five month average of delinquency. So that means per capita, like I said, went up $200 just per household compared to Kokomo, Tipton, and Sharpsville's averages of all three is $95 per capita. Interesting that uh, windfalls per capita is about $660 higher. Very interesting.